Basically, we have two tablets with uh, the new Snapdragon 810 processor, and they are YGIG enabled. So YGIG allows us to do a peer-to-peer -peer connection between the tablets. One of the tablets is the, the sync side. It's connected through HDMI to this nice 4K monitor. And the other tablet is where the content is. So basically, we are streaming from this tablet to the other, the other one and projecting into the TV. But in parallel to streaming 4K, we are also measuring how much is the available bandwidth on top of that. So we still have about 1.5 gigabits per second to do other stuff, copy files or do other stuff that we want on top of the 4K streaming. So I think that as, as files get bigger and bigger, people are just using 4K capable phones, creating their own, their own uh, content, and then they want to move the content from one side to the other. So either they will stream it to a TV or they will just want to copy it from one side to the other. When you have gigabytes of information, you are not going to wait minutes, tens of minutes to move the content around. Here we are talking about seconds and you will move it around. So why did, uh, will work with the Snapdragon 810, right? Yeah, so it's already in the market. It was launched last year in the market. And of course, now it's part of the A10 platform. And you will see it next year in the market. <laughs>